ਜਿਹੜੀ ਖਾਜਾ ਅਸਰੀ Thomas, I'm Mike. <laughs> All right. Um first question, uh this is the second to uh, your last show of the tour, which was uh one of your craziest tours. Craziest. Yeah, that you've tours? had. Mm-hmm. Well, probably the first uh, ones. Yeah, this was the first. Yeah, ones. well, we went on our first tour the day after we graduated high school in 2008. And uh what happened? <laughs> Our van broke down the very first day and we got towed to the first show. <laughs> and then it broke down. Two Every days show later. was there was not like I don't think there was really any good shows. Uh, there was a lot of, they were all bad. Pretty like there was 35 shows I'm pretty sure like 32 of them were bad. <laughs> oh wow. Yeah, this tour has been crazy though. Like we've all gotten along so well. Make or break. Yeah, we did it all very well. <laughs> Not good. for long. We one more day, so yeah. 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 it's time to fucking <laughs> crash, crash <laughs> down tonight. It's time to sever this shit. Let's not get too drunk then, huh? <laughs> <laughs> you guys are supporting your your brand new album, Hyper Vessel. Yes, Vessels. Um, how do you think you've changed from album to album? Uh, what do you think, Mike? <laughs> <laughs> I guess yeah. Um, I'll take this one. <laughs> um. Well, they sounded like shit on the first record. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I don't know. This record's the best record by far. Uh, songs are strong. They're mean. They're fast. This one, we were really strong songs. Strong songs. This record is written like us, like waking up. We'd get together early for practice, but we wouldn't drink any coffee, so it'd be really cranky. You write all the songs. <laughs> so angry. Just, yeah. Yeah. No, I don't. I don't know. It just live energy one. I don't, I don't know. It's a good. It captured our. The part of our band that's like. Uh, uh, mean. Mean. <laughs> Vibey. But it's like. I mean, it's, I think. I mean, like, because I'm not on the record. I didn't play on it, but it's like I think it's the best representation of this band. Like the record that they've been like, I don't know, they were supposed to make. I guess. <laughs> That's <just> cliche, <laughs> stupid. That's good. We were born to make this record. <laughs> what do you think uh, Ty Siegel brought to this particular? Just a bunch of negativity, a bunch of terrible. <laughs> <laughs> pull up all our bad reviews, read them to us. Uh, fame, fame, cheese platters, internet buzz. No. Charcuterie plates? I don't know. He's been our Thai. We've known Thai. Like, easy for a long promotional. Time. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> makes it easier to, to sell the record. <laughs> no. Uh, sticker. He brought yeah. a sticker to the cover of the record. <laughs> <laughs> no, he. We've known that dude for a long time. And he just wanted to record the album. And that was. It, I don't know. He, he knows the way we sound, so it made it yeah, easy to do. He's, he's known us for a long time, and he, and he, and he likes certain aspects of the band, I feel like he was able to capture that well. And I was so nervous around him the whole time that I think that it pushed it even further. He's, he's, he's a superstar. He's very yeah. handsome. <laughs> he, he loves to ask us if he can smoke in his own garage. On several labels, um, how have your like experiences with those labels been? All of them have been supportive. That's, yeah. that's the, the main. Real good. It's always it's like really good. friends of ours that are putting out stuff. It's nice. 
like any any record label that wants to put out a band stuff is a good thing, you know. But some record labels are better than others, for sure. Not not saying any of the ones that we've been on are bad, right. but from stuff I've heard, you know. Yeah, we've been sometimes, lucky. Sometimes releases don't go the way you hope, you know. Yeah. But we've we've been very blessed with uh, good record labels. Recess, Burger, Suicide Squad, Good, Wink and Spit, uh, Bowler, oh, Underground Government, Underground Government, Taken by Surprise. The only time we got duped was by uh, okay. Smoke and Barrel. Smoke and Barrel. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if Brandon, if you're fuck watching Brandon. this, fuck you, <laughs> oh, idiot, fucking <laughs> wannabe wrestler. Fat loser. Look at us now, Brandon. <laughs> look at us now, Brandon. Look at you. You're fucking jerking off in the Cha Cha Lounge bathroom. Look what we're doing. We're in the van, motherfucker. <laughs> A lot of people might not know that you guys um, are basically the first band that record that Burger put out, um, besides the founders themselves. Um, what do you remember most about those times? It's, it's in a haze of marijuana. I can't remember <laughs> anything. <laughs> I remember being like, who are these guys? Why do they like us so much? Yeah. And then just Lee's happy, flowery nature, and then Sean's like kind of businessy style. I don't know. I remember the first time cool. I saw the makeup okay. party, it was like, I was really, I thought it was really weird how high they sung. Their, their voices were very high. Yeah. But then the more times I saw them, it didn't... Like, the first time I saw them, I was like, this is insane how high they're singing. But then after a while, I got used to it. How Maybe do you at the time, they just... Yeah, I don't know. How do you like you? How do you like me in my birthday suit? <laughs> yeah. It's a great birthday suit song. It's a great song. Yeah. Actually, Mike used to be in a makeup party. He got kicked out, but he was in the band. <laughs> he did. He, Mike, yeah. Mike was he's like... He was a drummer. He was a drummer. He got kicked out, and they replaced him with Alex... And now Mike's on Audacity, so yeah. It's really going places. <laughs> <laughs> Take a look at our sweet tour van. <laughs> this van's pretty sweet. Don't knock it. <laughs> yeah, we don't know if it's going to work anymore <laughs> in a couple days, but we're figuring it out. It's turning a into a, just a man cave. But yeah. that doesn't move. <laughs> and, a, and a dog. And your dog. A little doggy. <laughs> Did you guys ever think you and Burger would be where you guys are at today? Uh... I mean, I honestly thought it'd be a little bit farther. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, at the time, it was—it just seemed like our our friends making a label, which like happens all the time. Yeah. Lots of people make record labels, but. And what's happened with Burger is like pretty insane to wrap your head around now. Yeah. Definitely. It's like going away. It's. I don't know. It's, it's a way it's, of life. Yeah, it's it's. Phenom. It's funny too because you always people are like, oh my god, you give the burger guys my stuff and all, and everyone like has this like big facade of like burgers, like <laughs> fucking like Trump Towers like shit. But it's just like Sean and Lee still like working on the computer, smoking a shit ton of weed in the back of the store. Like it's they're grind. still working, they're still out of grind too, but they're doing really well, which is rad. You guys have been going at it for a really long time. Um, since you were really young, is there any advice that you would? give to like kids starting out you know what don't be one of those puppeteer bands you fucking be yourself follow your dreams i don't know uh follow, follow, uh, follow just, the trend just always <laughs> you should probably like get into like science and math or something yeah. <laughs> actually just stay in school so, yeah turn back now <laughs> like uh if you're in a band, you know, just just do it. But know that it probably your band probably sucks. <laughs> Most likely, <laughs> statistically speaking, yep. your band's probably pretty bad. You should give up, a little weep. <laughs> no, never give up, and always sacrifice. Yeah, always sacrifice. Yeah, if you want to be in a band and you're serious about it, be serious about it. There's yeah. enough bands, you know. We have enough competition. Do something to set yourself <laughs> apart. Go become a scientist. <laughs> Did you want to become a scientist? Is that... No. 
<laughs> I was always bad at science. Science. Math. Yeah, but that's math's what I hear not my strongest subject either. The country needs more of probably less people like us. <laughs> <laughs> more scientists. We're scientists though. Of rock. I, I seek to understand things. <laughs> Is that scientific? It's pretty scientific. It's a little that's bit. what uh, Guided by Voices said. Shout out. Shout out. Robert Pollard. <laughs> Alright. Well, uh, this is Carly. The Cosmic Clash. Signing out. Dasty boys. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. My Cosmos.